Another experimental video with the man himself, Mr. Stretch Armstrong. You guys can never get enough of him. You guys are always talking about it in the comment section, asking to see more of him. So I'm back with another Stretch Armstrong video for you guys today. I don't blame you guys. This guy is freaking awesome. And basically, we found out through the different videos, this man is pretty much almost indestructible. There's actually been a new video that's been uploaded by another YouTuber where we found out he was bulletproof. He is an incredible toy. And today, we're going to be trying something different. So last video, we put him up against fire. We used a flamethrower on him, and it just made the dude more tan. And nothing really happened to for the most part. So today we're gonna try is the exact opposite, liquid nitrogen. So we tried fire, now we're gonna be trying ice and seeing exactly if that's maybe the kryptonite to stretch Armstrong. He's made out of like a syrup type substance which I think is gonna freeze pretty easy. So we're gonna be going through the same test we did in the first video with this dude, but we're gonna be putting him in liquid nitrogen first to see if that weakens him up and makes the test a lot more, like makes him a lot more vulnerable for those tests. So we're gonna be trying those tests and I have a bunch of new tests that we're gonna be trying on Mr. Armstrong. And like I said, seeing if liquid nitrogen is Mr. Armstrong's kryptonite. But anyway, let's get started. Alright guys, so right now we're outside. Here is the liquid nitrogen, a full tank of it. And right here, we've already found out that Stretch Armstrong is ridiculously terrible. There's no way to outstretch him. Impact damage is nothing to him. So I'm really interested to see if putting in liquid nitrogen makes him a little bit more susceptible to impact damage. Hopefully so, but like as I said, right now, this is a stretch point. I want to see if he can even stretch by being dipped in liquid nitrogen. We'll find out. All right, guys, so we're going to be putting him through a bunch of tests very similar to what we did last time, except for now he's going to be frozen to see if he can survive those same tests. We have multiple of them because I'm assuming at least one will break along the line, so there's a lot of them, but here he goes. He's taking the plunge. Oh! <laughs> Uh, pool is a little chilly today. Last <laughs> year my sports years in college, the ice bath. <laughs> Look at that stern face of manlyhood. Manliness. Zero fucks given. Can't tell this is a jacuzzi. <laughs> this is like the standard water like in this house. <laughs> <laughs> this is a day spa for stretch. Alright, let's pull him out. Oh, you can hear him crackling. <laughs> Wait, is that like lumps? Is that like lumps there before? Oh, that's cold. Ooh, he ain't stretching. He's not? <laughs> no, no. Try stretching like a leg or something like. <laughs> He's got like those like wrinkles, like a cellulite. <laughs> <laughs> we just made stretch to give a cellulite. <laughs> Looks like he's had three kids, yeah, the other cellulite. Oh my god. You hear that crunchiness? It's like it's slushy. It really is like all crunchy. You hear that? Yeah. What does it feel like? It feels like sand inside there. Well, let's do the next test, which is the impact test. Gotta put him back in here, though, for a bit to get him chill again. Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> we'll put him head first, because this part is already, like, solid. <laughs> <laughs> I waterboard for breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> so here we go. We're gonna be throwing Stretch Armstrong in the air and seeing how he reacts after being frozen. And honestly, makes him feel like he's just more toned. <laughs> he only gets manly. Right, here goes the impact test. Three, two, one. Whoa! <laughs> his head broke, but nothing else did. See his body, you ready? <laughs> he only got manly here, I'm telling you. He's like, I don't need this. <laughs> All those bubbles are just his exhale. <laughs> <laughs> He's breathing out right now. That's just all the air. <laughs> he has like one long breath. <laughs> this whole his whole body's lung. This <laughs> is so manly. All right, ready? Whoa! <laughs> Dude, I got that. <laughs> that was scary. He was like, "Fuck this!" <laughs> There's like shards of the blood. I won't let them take my manhood. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're gonna see if his body can take the impact. This is rock solid, right? Ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. What the fuck, dude? It sounded like you broke your concrete. Shoot. <sighs> I was a little bit dislocated, huh? <laughs> dude, he only got more tone. The only thing on his head was the only thing it broke. <laughs> <laughs> what? Ah, oh, you manly son of a bitch! We only made him more tone. All right, well, I guess it's gone to the next test. All right, we have another manly stretch arm show with a couple battle scars here. Now we're gonna see the sledgehammer test, all right? We are gonna take this manly son of a bitch down one way or another yet again today. I don't think he's gonna hold up to the sledgehammer as well as he did last time. I don't think so either. Oh my what? God. He's just, he's just, God. 
just <laughs> this is Marley, son of a bitch. He just took the hits. He just defrosted him really quick. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> we just healed the frostbite with impact. <laughs> he only gets manlier. <laughs> We are gonna take this manly son of a bitch down. Next test. All right, guys. So this whole video has been mainly just made by you guys. These are all requests you guys have told me, and one of them was Lucille. You guys saw a lot of other videos with Lucille. And you saw me use them on basically my chest, but this is a frozen stretch arm straw. So we're gonna see if Lucille has any effect on him. He just asked for it. So here we go. Oh! Oh my <gasps> God! Nothing. Oh, oh my. Alright, one final. This is every strength I have in my body right here. Ready? Yep. <sighs> oh, you, holy shit! Holy <laughs> you busted it. His body caved in the table. <laughs> He's like, oh, so you found my back scratcher, huh? <laughs> <laughs> and for those of you guys who remember when I bought this table, they said this table was indestructible. The person at the store told me this table is indestructible. Never met Stretch Armstrong. <laughs> <laughs> Why is every table I buy have to get a hole in it? <laughs> no matter how much money I spend on the table, this man breaks it. Hey, 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 take it easy. Hey, don't beat that boy with a banana. Ugh. My pee potassium. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So right here, we just got stretched out of his ice bath yet again. And this time we're gonna be throwing throwing knives at him, just like last time. But I'm thinking this time, maybe because he's so like rock solid, that maybe it'll be kind of act like a glass breaker, and the like the pinch, like you know, the, the pinpoint impact will shatter him. That's what we're going for. We're going for a shatter because he's everything else you put in the liquid nitrogen, like plastic. If you touch it, it shatters. Like his head did, because his head's made out of that. I don't. The body. That's one of the story. <laughs> so hopefully now that his body is so rock solid, the knives will work, work kind of like a glass breaker and shatter him. Basically, you're ready to take the hit stretch. Oh my god! What the hell? It sliced him, but. He bent the fucking what? knife! What? <laughs> it bent the fucking knife! Oh my god, dude! He. I don't even know what to say! He bit. This is steel! He bent the fucking steel knife with this torso! The man bit the steel! <laughs> oh you know what I think it is? I think he's just tired of us always trying to break him. She's like, I'm gonna break him. <laughs> Full force, all my strength going to this throw. Got this one. Oh, shit. There's another split, but just battle scars. He only, now he just looks like he's been through some kind of great war. <laughs> he's losing one limb at a time here. That's what Stretch Armstrong looks like, guys, when it's putting liquid nitrogen. It's like a frosty manliness. You're just touching liquid testosterone. <laughs> That is testosterone you're touching right now. All right, guys. So, the only way I'm thinking we'll be able to get a shatter on him is if it's like a pinpointed impact, you know, as hard as you can, like dead center of mass is the only way it's gonna work. So, the most powerful thing I have here is a crossbow. I know he's bulletproof, but crossbows can actually go through chain mail, a lot of things, and even actually Kevlar that bullets can't get through. So hopefully this can get through Stretch Armstrong while he's frozen, we'll find out. Three, two, one, go. Oh, oh, oh dude, you God. got him dead center. It still didn't go through him. Oh my God. <laughs> Holy crap, dude. This man's incredible. That would go through definitely me and definitely Parker. This one, the guy that shot it with a bullet, it went barely just in the flesh. This went a lot deeper than the bullet. This is almost the back right here. The only oh, thing that was able to go through was a shotgun slug. I thought a crossbow would do Oof. What? Went that deep in it, guys. Goes three, two, one. <laughs> I think that one may have went through him. Holy crap. That one went through him. That one went, oh, dude, <laughs> nice. <laughs> Finally. We pinned, we pinned him to the wall, guys. <laughs> Finally. Let's see exactly how far that one went in. <laughs> nice. That still says something about him that took two shots. Oh yeah. Two, that means if you had a stretch Armstrong in your front pocket and someone shot you with a crossbow, you could survive it. Give it back. Uh, 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 uh. 
All right, three, two, one. Oh! Wow. Pinned his head straight through there. I'm strong! Okay, so right here we have the world's smallest stretch Armstrong. Look at this little man. His legs are just so like... His father, father and son, right here. Little manliness and big manliness. Hey, Dad, what are we gonna go do today? Steroids. <laughs> just because we were curious, this couldn't warrant its own video. See, if little stretch Armstrong, who's about the size of the sledgehammer, <laughs> can take a hit from the sledgehammer. Oh my god. Crap, he took the hits. Hurt his arm a little bit, but he took those hits. What? Oh. <laughs> no way. He dodged it. He dodged it. Oh, no, he didn't. No, he didn't. <laughs> oh, sh Oh, my God. <laughs> my everything. My little leg. <laughs> my little manly leg. Why? Why? Oh. Yep. Oh, 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 oh. oh, right in the manly. Why? My sweet baby boy. He would just be manly if you shot him in the chest. I may be immortal, but there's still boundaries. He's my fucking son. <laughs> my son. My own flesh and man. He was made of 100% contrary testosterone. My testosterone. <laughs> we shall go. Oh. My All right, guys, so right over there is our frozen stretch Armstrong, and he is taped there because we are going to be cutting frozen stretch Armstrong, hopefully, with a chainsaw. I think this is definitely his kryptonite. We've already found out that liquid nitrogen is the kryptonite, but hopefully this is uh, Lex Luthor's the kryptonite. Guys, before we get into that, though, I want to see who the real geniuses are in the comment section. Let me know right now, yes or no in the comment section, will the chainsaw cut through the liquid nitrogen stretch Armstrong? Yes or no? Uh, no cheating, no skipping ahead to see if that actually happens. Right now, yes or no in the comment section, will the chainsaw cut through him? Hopefully does it clog up the machine. about two and a half men. <laughs> that was so easy. It just slid right through. Yeah, I think I, I don't think it would have happened if he was like not frozen. That's what I'm saying. Liquid nitrogen is Stesh Armstrong's kryptonite, literally. That would not have happened. If he would have been normal, that would have clogged up the chainsaw. But it's because it's frozen, it's almost like he was made out of like like sand, like salt almost like a salt rock. Yeah. Like really like a brittle type of rock. So that went through like butter. I didn't, I, didn't I never thought we'd find so his true weakness. And that is 